your host Jason. In this video, I will be showing you how to put Calendly on Canva website. Once on your Canva website, as you can see right here, you're going to create a blank page. So you can either tap on add page if you have other pages on your Canva website, or you can go over to the left hand menu option. And from there, you could tap on add page right here. After you have done that, I want you to open a new tab and you're going to go on to Calendly. Once you have done that, we can create our calendar or booking calendar right there. So you can tap on new event type right here or you can select schedule events or event type at the top right here. After you have done that, you can choose whether you'd like to create one for a one-on-one -on -one meeting, group meeting or collective or around Robin. Let's say, for example, we were to select one on one. After you have done that from there, you can give the event a name. So we are just going to call it test event and you can choose the duration as you can see right here. Then you can choose the location, whether it is Zoom, phone call, in person, or you can tap on all options right there. After you're finished, you're going to tap on continue in the bottom left hand corner. Once you have tapped on continue, all you'll need to do now, you can see that we have now created our booking calendar right here. So all we'll need to do now, you can go over to the top left hand corner, tap right where you see share. After tapping on share, what I want you to do is tap on copy link. After you have tapped on copy link, you're going to go back into Canva and you're going to tap on text from the left hand menu option. After selecting text, you're just going to add a text box. Once you have added the text box from there, you can pull it to the top left or you can put it wherever you want on the page. And you're going to select the entire text box. After selecting the text box, you're going to tap on the link icon and you're going to paste in the link that you have copied. Then from there, you're going to tap where you see link mode and you're going to select embed. After selecting embed, you can see our Calendly calendar is being added right there. Once it has been added, you can adjust how it looks. So you can simply pull on it right there and you can also move it into the middle of the page if you want. After doing that, you can adjust it right there so we could increase the size. Then if we were to tap on preview, you can see how it looks. So this is how it looks right there, as you can see right there. So someone will be able to go onto it and from there they can set a date. So for example, if I were to select that, then I could tap on the time, then tap on next. And from here they can fill in their details, meaning their name, email address, and then tap down here to continue with their booking. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.